all right all right what's good everyone it's no acls and i'm back with another game review today i'm looking at tearing spaces where legends are born and battles never end now courtesy of waypoint gaming i've been privileged to access this game early in its closed beta stages and this is a moba pve vp rpg with 3v3 action and it boasts triple a quality currently utilizing unreal engine 4 and yeah the closed beta has been rolling through its development stages and the demo is also live so i'm gonna dive into a little bit of the lore here and then we will take a look at the game so just a little intro to tearing spaces the legend states that there was a time where battle of ancient gods took place aeons ago our universe was forged by ancient and powerful gods who maintained order and authority while immortal, these gods possessed very mortal weaknesses, chief among them, jealousy. A new goddess awoke, born of pure light and goodness, who quickly gained power and influence. This threatened many of the other gods. The gods waged war to defeat the newborn goddess and sealed her away for eternity in a cosmic void. Over time, the goddess transformed into a planet called Atus, giving birth to a multitude of diverse creatures. Over the course of many ages, the seal which bound the goddess gradually loosened, and the magic power of the goddess began to escape and permeate inside and outside of the planet. Time and space could not withstand such power, and cracks began to appear, forming a strange, broken land. That land is tearing spaces. So there's a brief introduction to the lore. Let's roll through the website at tearingspaces.com to get a brief overview on what we can expect from this game. Let's do it. All right, so let's continue to roll through tearingspaces.com and get a brief overview of the project. Tearing Spaces gameplay, as mentioned, boasts a 3v3 action-packed PvEVP role-playing game experience. Both teams need to defeat their respective bosses in order to win. However, both teams have the option to portal to each other's arena for a preemptive strike. It's a race against time. Do you think you've got what it takes? So this live action battle experience where you are basically in a PvE arena attempting to complete your boss wave faster than your opponent's team and you also have the function where you can jump into their battle and disturb their strategy and try to get the upper hand. So very interesting feature there. The team combat aspect as boasted here on tearingspaces.com. Prepare yourself with a wide range of weapons from ranged to melee to magical, do you have what it takes to devise the perfect strategy that will wipe your opponent's face across the floor? The weapons are there, the choice is yours. So speaking of weapons, the weapons are there. There are tons of weapons, there's a plethora of them in this game, and just featuring a few of them on the homepage here, any character is capable of using any weapons, weapons differ in their rarity and attributes, and the game will include six free weapons with the remainder only available as premium digital collectibles, NFT weapons, where you can then earn in-game resources and further progress, right? So looking at a few weapons here on the homepage, we've got the Abyssal Skeleton. We've got the Sylph's Gift. We've got Poseidon's Fallen Trident. Lady of Ashes Blade. Very cool, very cool. Divine Redemption. And gluttony Kayla so just a few highlighted weapons here on the homepage but there is an entire armoire of weapons in game which you will get a glimpse at in a moment so let's continue to roll through the web page here let's go we're gonna take a look at the trailer some gameplay footage and continue to roll through tearing spaces
Very cool. Unreal Engine 4. Let's go. Tearing Spaces trailer looking very hype. So let's take a look at some gameplay footage as well. Just a brief glimpse here at some of the MOBA action within the Tearing Spaces arena. Just a quick highlight here. The chaos that unfolds on the battlegrounds. Nice. So I like that the webpage has a few highlights, you know, just easy to, to access and featured right there so you can see the gameplay. Love it. Looks hype and... I have had the opportunity to play it. It is very fun, very action-packed, very fast-paced. And that element of competing against another team in real time to go through a boss wave is pretty exciting. So just a few highlights. This game is in cooperation with some big partners. We've got Polygon, Magic Eden, Elixir, Fractal, just to name a few of the well-known backers here within the Web3 community. Love to see it. And just a few resources you may want to check out regarding Tearing Spaces. Of course, across all socials, at Tearing Spaces. You can check out Magic Eden and OpenSea to get refreshed on the Celestials rollout, which was pretty interesting related to the lore and core storyline here of Tearing Spaces. But overall, that is a brief overview on a few things that I felt were pretty interesting before we dive into the game. Let's go ahead and take a look at the game itself. Let's play some Tearing Spaces. Let's go. All right, so let's dive into the game. We're going to go through this tutorial of the tournament and experience the heroes in action. Let's do this. Welcome to Tearing Spaces. This is a 3v3 racing game. You need to cooperate with players on the same team to defeat the boss before the opponent and win. Very nice. Press WASD to control the hero and move. Press the spacebar to roll. Let's go. Awesome. Left click to perform normal attacks. And different types of weapons have different attack performance. Attack hits can reduce the monster's health, and the monster will be defeated when the health reaches zero. Defeating all the monsters in the room opens up the next room. Alright. Let's use a few attacks here. Boom. Boom, boom. Take down. All right, moving into the next room. There will be elite monsters that appear in the room. Elite monsters are larger, stronger, and can cast powerful abilities. Each hero has an exclusive hero skill. Each weapon has two weapon skills. Use skills to destroy enemies faster. All right, let's go. Fireballs, boom, boom, boom. We got some skills here. We're using E on them, boom. Roll in. A little bit of damage, that's fine. The passage between the two battle rooms is a rest area, and there is a recovery altar in the rest area. When the hero stands on it, the health can be continuously recovered. In addition, the hero can get one bottle of potion every 40 seconds, which can immediately restore 20% of the hero's health and continuous recovery for 5 seconds. Whenever entering the rest area, players can activate one of the three talents that appear to get the bonus effect. Let's go. I see the bonus effects here. So we're gonna go with... Glory Spirit summons clones to attack. Let's go, we got a clone here. Let's attack. Ooh, a game needs to go through three battle rooms. The last room is the boss room. After defeating the boss, the battle ends. Okay. Let's get it. Let's defeat this boss. Now we do have F for potions. So no stress. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Knock out here. And that's a victory. Awesome. So that's the tutorial. There's a glimpse at how Tearing Spaces gameplay unfolds. That's the PvE aspect. We're diving in. Let's go. Alright, let's just go in. Being a little creative with the username. No ACLs with 4th A. Let's go. We enter the game. 
Awesome. Now let's dive in to a PvP match here. Let's go. Keep in mind, the quality of the beta gameplay does not represent the final version. Let's go. So it's a 3v3 matchup. It's a PvE! PP! 3v3! Let's do it. Okay. Interesting mechanics here. Ooh. Gotta stay out of the range of these attacks. Nice. Teamwork. Stay focused. We need to defeat these enemies faster than the opposition team. Let's go. Like you, bro. Keep it rolling. We got this team. So we're currently in the first wave. One teammate down. Ooh, I'm in the arena of my opponents right now. I'm gonna try and interfere with them. Give them a little bit of a challenge over here. Come on, team. While I keep them busy. Let's go. Alright, back with my squad. I was able to interfere with the opposition. Back in the mix. Okay. We got this. I believe we can do this faster than our opponents. We're making good time right now. Going to heal up fully. My teammates should have done that as well, but it's okay. They're aggressive. Ooh, opposition's in with us now. We've gotta eliminate them. Got some force for you. Got some DPS coming down. Ooh, I'm going for the heal. Oh, it's down. Looks like I'm down. Check out other players' views. Okay, okay. Check out our opponents. Alright, I'll be back up in two seconds. Let's go. Let's go, team. We are going to best them. Let's go, squad. Going in right now. Chaos. Absolute chaos. We're not even at the boss fight yet. Let's go. Come on, squad. Triple up, triple up. Potions. Keep it moving. Press. We can do it. The lead. Continue to push. Doing everything we got right now. We got this. On to the next stage. Be sure to heal. Right. Just out of range. This is the serious fight. We are in the boss arena. Can we best our opponents? We clear this arena within a faster time frame. 3v3 action. Tearing spaces. Ooh. Classic dungeon crawler vibes right now. Let's go. Give them everything. Got this team. I will not waver. Our time is now. Let's get out of the radius of those projectiles, taking a moment to heal up. 
good enough for me. Let's go. Give it up everything we've got. I will not surrender. Where's my team? I'm the one here putting all the DPS on the boss. Come on, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Keep it rolling. Enemies are coming into our arena to interfere with us. I've got something for them. I've got something. I've got some juice here. Stir things up. Where are my teammates? Come on, guys. We got this. They're in here messing around with us. Two at low health. Down and out. We're in this to win this right now. Pressure is on. The battle is intensifying. Time continues to push forward. Ooh. Had to get out of there in time. Nice. Another kill on the board. I'm doing everything right now to go for the MVP on my team. Let's go. Let's go. some potions. Ooh, that was deadly. Still at it. Pressing as hard as we can right now. Let's go. This boss battle is intense. It's looking like we have the upper hand at the moment. Come on, guys. Ah, dive roll elements. I need my potion. Ah, it's so close. Keep going. Giving everything I've got. I'm going for the heal. Getting out of range. Oh no! Just at the healing pad. Down. It looks like we're going to get this one though. I believe in our team. We've got the upper hand. Enemies trying everything to thwart us right now. And I'm back. I'm back on the field. I'm back in the arena. And I go... Straight for the boss. Giving everything I have. Taking advantage of the time where our opponents are not trying to interfere with our strategy, take away from our damage. MVP! Let's go! Ah, GG's. Very intense live 3v3 action there in a PvEVP experience. Very exciting. Very high impact. What a match. Loving it. Tearing spaces. Let's go. All right, awesome. So that's a demonstration of the PVE VP aspect there, the live battles. We've also got a wide range of heroes in the game. There's stamina elements, various things to keep the gameplay balanced. Just going through some of the heroes here. We've got Uriel, we've got Haley's, Ralegu, Mesli, Brolin, and Juite. Nice. You can also check out the wide variety of weapons available in the game as well. All with specific attributes, all with the ability to earn in-game resources and rewards love to see it various rarities you know how it goes welcome to the rpg experience of tearing spaces so a lot of very interesting weapons available poseidon's fallen trident was the one i chose to go with recently but you can 
see there's a wide variety of weapons here that we are able to utilize within this closed beta experience. So overall, very exciting, very interesting gameplay, highly strategic, highly competitive, liking where things are at right now with tearing spaces, still extremely early in the development process as this is the closed beta. We're coming up on a release here in the not so distant future. Keep your eyes open, tearing spaces coming soon. Let's go. All right, all right. So overall, my tearing spaces experience during the closed beta has been very enjoyable. I have to say that this PvE VP 3v3 MOBA RPG, although it is a mouthful, it is very fun. And I like the fact that, you know, you can choose your weapons, heroes, talents before entering the match and the uniqueness of the game element where you're live in a 3v3 battle in a pve arena trying to kill the boss before your opponents do the same in their arena but then you also have the element where either team can enter portals and appear in the arena teleport to your opponent's field of battle and launch an ambush so your strategy comes down to the situation in battle do you race to the finish and try to get that victory as soon as you can or do you sabotage your enemy at that point in the battle in order to get an upper hand so overall pretty interesting looking forward to more from tearing spaces can't wait to see what this game brings next but until next time take it easy everyone peace